Hello everyone, Ryane Seiji here, of course, and welcome to the Let's Play Elimination Challenge Olympics. I messed up the order, but that's okay. So, um, Hutch, a guy who is on SocksMakePeopleSexy.net, I think he was a judge for a couple of the competitions or something, he's uh, running this thing. This thing where basically it works like one of those stupid reality shows, you know. We got, um, certain amount of stuff and if you have the lowest point total what are these red orbs I have no idea I'm just getting warm um ow <laughs> wow I I suck at ninja guy so bad but uh you stupid what are those things even they look like pig beetles or I don't even know and what is with these weird red things well, anyway, um, oh yeah, that's right, you can climb up walls and crap in Ninja. NG, as it were. At least it's not like Ninja Guide in Black or Ninja Guide in 3. <laughs> yeah, jokes. Jokes involving games that are out. So we have two bars there, Ninja and Enemy, and I'm really hoping I'm not accidentally going to activate a special weapon, because I've been known to do that. Like, right before this recording started. I also think this is endless, and I'm going to just ignore those guys. See, things about these games is knowing who not to kill and who to kill. And also knowing how to get off this friggin' wall. Okay. No, I... These... So many things are going on on the screen right now. But, um, basically, you know, we have a whole bunch of us, like... Returning contestants, Rort. That was uh, apparently a bad thing. Oh, I'm supposed to clutch the wall, aren't I? That's stupid! Okay, well, whatever. Um. There's uh, Tajirs in this. Um. But a bunch of people. And I think Heavy Metal Mage, too. Um. Or no, I think he said he wasn't. And I have no idea how I'm supposed to hit this guy. Just stab him in the back. Yeah, this is this is working brilliantly. What are you talking about? <laughs> um, do I at least start from? Okay, starting from here is not too bad as long as I don't get hit by anything, which would be pretty difficult to do. But um, all right, let's see. How should I do this? Well, I can climb up this wall which will allow me to get behind him and almost stab him. He does a lot of damage to me just running into me though, so I don't think I can cheese him. Yeah, cheesing, cheesing is not working. Though, we do almost have him. And uh, one of the challenges for this game is not to use the special weapons, which I screwed up within the first 40 seconds of the first recording because I didn't know how to play this, and then I practiced a bit, you know, just to get familiar with the controls, but basically I'm playing it blind because I think it would give the best commentary. And that's the main focus of this competition, instead of a mix of different things, I guess. Um, we're supposed to just put in our best commentary that we can, so that's what I'm trying to do here. Um, whoa, okay. Don't know what I was stuck on there, it was definitely not the wall though. Alright. Knowing how to play this game, though, definitely helps a bit. Oh! You can break those things and they give you special things, except I'm not allowed to use them, so... That's... great, I guess? I hope I didn't pick up anything that would ruin my chances of getting that whatever... MacGuffin bonus point, or whatever it is this time around. But, uh, yeah. So... Um, before this week started, we had a choice. There are two enemies, I guess, or something. I'm not that familiar with it, but I did watch the Him Daisy Hyperdub. But, um, Metal Gear Solid 2, Raiden, and Solidus Snake. Which is not Solid Snake, he's Solidus, and he's like, uh, an evil bad guy dude thing, or something. Oh, jeez. He does that kind of without warning about... I'm just gonna keep slashing you if you just keep slowly approaching me like that. There we go! I actually beat the first stage of a Ninja Gaiden game. 
I'm pretty proud of myself there. <laughs> we don't need cutscenes. Okay, so now we're on the train. That's great. Anyway, um, I picked Raiden because I've been playing a game. It's known as PlayStation All-Stars or Battle Royale, something like that. It's like the Super Smash Brothers games on the Wii and the Nintendo systems, only, um, you know, that system, which is uh, something else, which is, uh, you know, the system. PS3, yeah. And uh, I was playing as Raiden a bit, though um, I honestly, my main is Sly, and I'm pretty excited for uh, Sly Thieves in Time coming out. I also have no idea what I just picked up. I don't know any of this stuff I'm picking up. What am I talking about? Um, what the? How did you. What? Die! Oh, wait. Hold on. Is that a. Um. Oh, this must be that Shadow Clone thing that they were talking about. Um. I'm apologizing profusely for activating this. Please don't take my points away. <laughs> because I have no idea how this works. Um, apparently I'm picking up genie bottles and that does it. So he's a ninja genie clone shadow of the shadows. That sounds like a Naruto thing. Could totally be a Naruto. Yep. <laughs> oh man. I watched a lot of Naruto when I was like, um, in high school. When I was first being introduced into the idea of anime, until I learned that Pokemon, Digimon, and all those were also anime. But, um, details. Uh, there's wind here. There is wind here. Oh, no, 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 no. Um, what am I supposed to do? Okay, I guess that works. Except now I can't get off. Oh, okay. Don't know how I did that, and honestly, I don't think I could ever replicate it. Wow, he's he's just like a Chuck Charlie dude guy in uh, Mario's. Ow. Except maybe just a bit more muscular. Just just a bit though. So I'm probably going to game over here. It's awesome. See my P counter up in the top right? It says zero, and I'm stuck again. Get off. Okay. Well, I got that guy. No problem. Okay, the best way to deal with those guys is to rush them and not jump when I'm pressing the jump button. Thanks, uh, Ryu Hayabusa, or whatever your name is. Or if it's even Ryu, I don't even know. Um, huh. Apparently, I have unlimited continues. That's pretty cool. Unless I... It's like a counter that doesn't exist. And we're gonna f be seeing me fall here a lot. The music's pretty nice, though. But anyway, as I was trying to say, um, if you pick Saldus, you get one of my favorite games of all time, Sonic the Hedgehog 3 and Knuckles, which of course I will be LPing after uh, Ape Escape stuff. But instead, you know, I did pick Raiden because, like I said, I just threw a ninja star, I am an idiot. <sighs> well, so much for that. <laughs> I might as well just go all out now. Wait, did I have to not use him? Because, okay, uh, these controls are not working with this stage, let me tell you. Why is it up and B? I mean, I realize there are only two buttons on the NES controller, but you could have made it something else. I'm not sure what. Um, you could press select, I guess? Yeah, select would have worked, you know? Yeah, I think we definitely have unlimited continues. That's great. I will definitely never LP this game, I can tell you that for a fact. But, um, so, yeah, I I really regret picking Raiden. I didn't realize, um, what it meant to pick one of the two, because I only know what I know from the Him Daisy comic dub. And I remember Raiden being, like, a super whiny kid or something. Yeah, that sounds about right. Man, the Him Daisy comic dub, pretty great. You sh you guys should check that out. Uh, <laughs> jumping over this chasm is literally impossible for me. As a person who's never played Ninja Gaiden before. Let's play a game, viewers. It's called Count How Many Game Overs I Get in the Next 30 Seconds. Oy, 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 oy. <laughs> oh man, this... 
this is just is not working out. <laughs> ah, ah! How do you... There must be a trick to it, and I'm going to figure it out, because I'm going to have to learn it. Otherwise, I'm pretty much stuck here for the rest of the video. Just doing this one part over and over, killing these dudes who throw the rocks. Alright, now let's see. Well, that's propelling me. Or it was. Huh. Okay, so you... You throw ninja stars automatically being on the wall. That's not fair. Okay, um... Jump off, but not all the way! Ah, oh, you idiot! Man, this doesn't control as well as I'd like it to. Gonna be honest here. Don't know what those blue things are, but they do have a kanji on them. A kanji I don't recognize, but a kanji. You know, kanji are Chinese characters that the Japanese um, inherit in some of their language to express things and stuff. Yeah. Oh, jeez. I would be the worst language teacher ever, let me tell you. The only real kanji I know are, like, really basic ones, like dog. The kanji for dog is, like, three strokes. One, two... Yeah, three strokes. So, yeah. that That's what I've been reduced to talking about here. Just talking about random kanji that I know. Because... I definitely can't talk about ninja stuff. Now, if you want a good ninja anime, though, I will say that. Um, what was the name? Nabari no O. Uh, uh, I can't remember exactly what it translates to. Um, o is king. So it's king of something. King of Nabari. <laughs> Whatever that means. Um... Uh, yeah, uh, so, that's a good ninja anime. There's also, um, 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 I can't think of anything else. If I game over here, which I probably will, uh, that'll be the end of the video, because he said 12 to 15 minutes, and that's 12 minutes and 17 seconds. So, that's all for this episode, and hopefully not the last, though he did say we aren't getting eliminated in the first round, which is nice, because, wow. I... I am so terrible at Ninja Gaiden. So yeah, join me next time when we go and play a different game that's not Ninja Gaiden. And if it is, uh, I might quit. <laughs> no, not really. But I, I... it would cross my mind. I'm gonna go play Pokemon now. Until then! Later, guys.